how to add users on Amnesia VPN self-hosted and how to connect as a newly added user. If you haven't watched my previous video on how to create an Amnesia self-hosted VPN on a cloud server, then you should do so as this is a continuation from that video. I'll put it as a link in this video description below and as a card at the top right hand corner of this video. As you can see, I've got my Amnesia VPN client open and I have already logged into the Amnesia self-hosted VPN. I've got my self-hosted DigitalOcean Singapore server here. As you can see, we're currently in home. Now to add new users, you'll need to click on the share button here, which is to the right of home. So I'm just going to click on it. At the top here, it says share VPN access and we're currently in the connection tab, share VPN access without the ability to manage the server. First, you'll need to pick a username for your new client or user. So I'm just going to delete the pre-typed information in here and let's call the new user John. If you have multiple servers from different countries added to your Amnesia VPN client, you can click on this drop down arrow for server and select your appropriate server. Now I only have one called Digital Ocean Singapore. Again for protocol, if you have multiple protocols, just click on this arrow and select the protocol that you want. I only have one protocol installed on this server and that's X-Ray. And then again for the connection format, you can click on this arrow and select the connection format, which is the client that the user will use. Now this may be protocol specific, but I'm going to be going with the Amnesia VPN app. So I'm just going to click on that and all that's left to do now is to click on share. You'll then see all the available options to share this VPN service access with. So you can simply click on the share button here and you can save the amnesia config file .vpn somewhere on your device and then you can give that to the new user. I'm going to click on cancel. You can also click on copy here which will copy the connection settings. So if I click on show connection settings this is what you've copied. Everything starting from vpn colon slash slash. I'm going to go back and finally you have the QR code where the user can simply scan the QR code by reading it in the amnesia app. Selecting add server I have data to connect QR code, key or settings file. So you can follow these instructions here. I'm going to scroll back up to the top. Now I'm going to go with the connection settings option, which is where I clicked on copy. So I'm just going to click on copy here to copy the VPN colon slash slash key. Okay, now that I've got that copied, I just want to go back to the share VPN access window. So I'm just going to click at the top here. And now instead of being in the connection tab, let's click on users. We now should see all the users that we have added to our Amnesia VPN client. As you can see, the admin is me and John is the new user. So if I click on this arrow here, here, you can see the creation date. I can rename this user or I can revoke John's access. Now I'm not going to do either of these. I'm just going to click at the top here to go back. Okay, great. So that concludes the first part of this video, which is showing you how to add new users to share VPN access. Now what I'm going to do is show you how that newly added user can log in to Amnesia VPN. I'll first need to remove my admin account from the Amnesia VPN client. The new user won't need to do this part of the video. So I'm going to click on the cogwheel icon here. I'm going to click on servers. I'm going to select the Digital Ocean Singapore server. I'm going to click on management and then I'm going to click on remove server from application and then I'm going to click on continue. Okay so this is exactly what a new user will see when they first open up the Amnesia VPN client. They're going to click on get started and then they're going to paste in the VPN colon slash slash key that you shared with them so it's the one that I copied earlier or they can add the configuration file that you shared or scan the QR code that you shared. So I'm going to paste in the key so I'm just going to right click and click on paste and then I'm going to click on continue and then I'm going to click on connect and there we go the Digital Ocean Singapore server with the the X-Ray Vision protocol has been added to their client. As you can see, this is the current IP address and all they need to do is simply to click on connect. And there we go, we are now connected. Now, if they want to check if Amnesia VPN is working correctly, they should open up their browser and navigate to whatismyipaddress.com. I'm going to hit enter on my keyboard and then they'll be able to see their newly masked IP address, which is this one right here for IPv4. And if I open up the Amnesia app, you can see that the IP address at the bottom here is the same that is displayed in whatismyipaddress.com. You can see the location is Singapore and this is the location on the map. Okay, so that pretty much concludes this video on how to add users on Amnesia VPN self-hosted and how to connect as a newly added user. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Wait, is it so